can you tell us a little bit about the movie, what the story is about? Um, in short, the story is about uh, a young family, a young God-fearing family. The father is a, a young pastor who gets a phone call from a pastor in another community uh, asking him to take over the congregation because he's retiring. So the family decides to move from the city into basically the country and s set up shop there. And what ends up happening is the sort of innocent, unknowingly move into a very sinister situation. And it is uh, an event that happens every so many years where the gates of hell open up and they have to be, it has to be given an offering. Is this the, the first movie you've produced? It is the first movie I've produced, yeah. And how was it? It was great. It was, it was crazy. Um, it was not an easy like production. Everything that could go wrong went wrong. So it was a really great learning experience, a great hands-on learning experience. And it was a lot of fun, and I'm crazy now over it. I want to do another one. And so I've been working on doing more movies ever since this one was finished. If you could go back, what would you have done differently from the production? Uh, that's a good original question. Um, I think I don't like to look in hindsight. Um, I don't believe in it, but if I if I were to go back, yeah, I would definitely change a few things, um, which I'm not going to get into specifics about. Okay. And what was the most amazing thing about scoring a movie? Um, well, you know, I mean, all things considered, working with Nicholas O'Toole, who was my scoring partner, was great. We had a, a, an amazing synergy while we were scoring the movie. Um, just coming up with melodies that fit the movie as easily as, as they came to me, you know, just based off the script before we even started production, was, was one of those kind of like uh, wonderful moments. Um, and then, you know, just putting it all together, you know, I love the process. Yeah. Um, would you do it again, scoring? Oh, I will be doing it again. Yeah, for every, every movie that I produce, I will be involved with the music in some way, shape or form. Servant Lord, and commend her immortal soul to your everlasting care. Have you ever felt anything paranormal? Seen any ghosts? Anything like that? Um, yeah, I was. I've been around a few different experiences that were um, sort of ghostly. I guess, for want of a better word. Um, sometimes I was not in the right frame of mind, so it might not count. <laughs> <laughs> and did you? Did, did anything happen during the filming of this movie that you know? No, that's funny. It, it seems to be a commonly asked question. Nothing, nothing supernatural or extremely bizarre happened during the, making the movie that I know of. Oh. <laughs> um, do you remember the first horror movie you ever saw? Um, let's see. When I was a little kid in England, there was a movie called Trog. And it's not, it was a horror movie slash science fiction movie. And it was basically about a caveman that's discovered in the modern era. And it was very, really good movie, but it was in Britain when I saw it. And the other movies that I saw in England around that time was like Quasimodo, The Hunchback, the Hunchback of Notre Dame, um, House of Usher with Vincent Price, and also The Raven with Vincent Price and Peter Lorre and Jack Nicholson. Um, a few of those different sort of uh, older horror movies I saw when I was little. The first one that really scared me though is when I'd moved stateside and I went to see Night of the Living Dead. Um, is horror your favorite genre? Yeah, yeah. I mean, I, I love movies in general, but I have a, a certain affinity for horror movies. Do you have a favorite? I, well, my go-to favorite, I always say, is The Omen. But there's so many. I mean, we could sit here all day and I could pick out great horror movies. And we don't have that kind of time. So I'll say The Omen because uh, it was one of the the, the most well-rounded, best directed, best cast, best story, feature horror movies that I saw when I was young. How do you feel the music, um, what's the role of music in this kind of movies? It's, it's, the music and the sound design is an integral, it's almost like a character. One of the, the key components in the effectiveness of a horror movie. What are you afraid 
Um, I, I get asked that a lot too. I mean, I'm, I'm, I, you know, I'm, I'm scared of probably the same basic things that other people are scared of. You know, uh, having somebody pop up in your car when you get into it in the middle of the night. You know, I mean, basic <laughs> stuff. But I mean, I, the only sort of deep underlying fear that I have is going to the dentist. 